Now, Two News Oklahoma weather. Good Wednesday afternoon, everyone. I'm meteorologist Brandon Woolley here in the Two News Weather Center with your latest forecast. We have the cloud cover back in the picture across the area today because changes are working in later today, overnight through tomorrow on your Thursday. Chance for a few showers and storms around green country on our Wade's RV weather camera network. So now spring is officially here. It started officially last night at 10.06 Central Time. So today is the first full day of spring. The last full day of spring will be coming up on June 19th. So that is in the next couple of months. Now, of course, with spring comes allergies. I'm certainly suffering today. I woke up itchy eyes everything into the mix. So trees right now into the high stage because of oak, mulberry, and that darn red cedar still low for mold spores and non-existent for grasses and weeds here in the area. And of course, with spring, we've been talking about this controlled agriculture burns still continuing around the area. As we zoom down, most of the activity is naturally in throughout Osage County, so don't be surprised if you see or smell some smoke in the air today. Another cold shot is on the way for early next week. More freezing temperatures could be on the way behind a strong cold front that will move through on Monday, dropping those overnight lows and morning temperatures by Tuesday morning, some places could dip to below freezing across northeast Oklahoma. On future track radar in the cloud cover this afternoon, we're expecting mostly cloudy to partly cloudy conditions, maybe a few isolated showers or storms. Looks like the coverage of those showers really starting to ignite by this evening and overnight as that system gradually and slowly moves in from the west. We'll take any rain showers we can get. We definitely need the rainfall. 76 degrees for later this afternoon. South winds between about 5 and 15 miles per hour. Daytime highs today once again easily into the 70s. We have low to the mid 70s. The average for this time of year is of course cooler at 65. It's been pretty warm lately. Here's your latest seven day forecast. We have upper 60s tomorrow and Friday and then low to the mid 60s over the weekend. Another chance for showers and storms Sunday and and again, especially on Monday, Monday, that heightened chance at around 60%. And then by Tuesday morning, behind that strong cold front, we could see those temperatures right around freezing. That mark there at 32 degrees, 35 right now in the city of Tulsa.